Okay, guys, thanks for tuning into my channel. This is Jess Netta. Today is Thursday, October the 23rd. So a week from tomorrow, I'll be doing my month in weigh-in, which I haven't weighed myself all month. And I have a fitness haul for you today. All these items I got over the last couple weeks on clearance. I want to get this video recorded so I can go ahead and take the price tags off this stuff and start wearing them. My voice is going out because I'm just dealing with the cold right now. So um, excuse my voice, and I'm going to be talking fast because of that because it will go out you know the more I talk it'll get drier so real quick if you're interested in picking up a few items which I think will just kind of add a little motivation if you're working out regularly um, this is a good time of year to get it Target Walmart TJ Maxx Old Navy they all have their fitness items on clearance this shirt is just a real cute um, bright orange shirt that I picked up from TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx, all their stuff was kind of picked over. That shirt I got for $6. I just really like the bright color in that. So that was the only item from TJ Maxx. These next three items came from Target. A pair of drawstring workout pants. And they're stretchy. Real cute. Just simple. These were um, $9. And all the items were on clearance and I won't bother to hold up so you can see the price. I'm just going to tell you how much they were. Um, this is really cute tank top and it's um, a nylon, real soft nylon material, just a cute gray color. And I like tanks. I just wear sports bras underneath them and it allows me to move free without being worried with, you know, messing with my shirt. Less is more when I'm working out, I have learned. This shirt came from Target, a bright pink, super bright pink, like a muscle shirt, $6.48, that was from Target, and then the rest of the items came from Old Navy, Workout Warrior, and all of the shirts were $4.99. I'm going to actually watch their clearance rack to see if they drop them down because they were 7 now they're $4.99. <clears throat> This gray tank, which they had a lot of these gray tanks with different sayings on them. This one says, free your mind. This one says, be bold. And I just get my um, sports bras from Walmart. I like to buy just a pack of those. And I've already, I had a ton of those already. And I did pick up a new pack just to have a fresh pack. But um, they're real cheap at Walmart. USA cute tank top and then this one all the tank tops were $4.99 and then I got a pair of pants I think I thought these are really cute stretchy nylon real thick material these were <clears throat> these weren't on clearance they were just on sale they were $26.94 on sale for $15 and they had a pink pair and a purple pair. And I'm going to actually wait and see if they actually go on clearance. So, And then I'll get the other two. So I paid $15 for those. So that's it for my clothes. And then I desperately needed a new pair of sneakers to work out in. So I wanted to go with the Five, Fe five Finger Vibrams. And I purchased these a couple weeks ago. And they are the most comfortable shoes I've ever put on my feet. Ever. They have a different feel to them. They feel like you're walking barefoot, but with a little protection. And um, I'll just give you my quick review of these. Now, they're, um, when I posted a picture of these on my um, Fitbit group that I'm in, I got a lot of backlash. People were saying, well, there was a class action lawsuit. People said that they were hurting their feet, hurting their ankles, and all of that stuff. So these aren't for everybody. And there's class action lawsuits on a lot of the products that we use. So that wasn't a deterrent for me. I did my research. I watched videos prior to buying these. And I decided to buy them. And I'm really glad that I did. So when I first put them on, I had to, you know, work with my toes to try to get them in these little slots. Now when I put them on, I just slip them on just like that. Also, when I first warm, and it is suggested that you only wear them for like 30 minutes at a time to get your, your feet used to wearing them. After a couple of days, my feet were sore, my calves were sore, and my stomach muscles were sore. And sore like when you, after you've weight trained, and then the next couple of days, your, your muscles are sore. That's how my feet, calves, and my stomach muscles felt. 
So these shoes cause you to, without even thinking about it, they cause you just to stand upright, like in an upright position. It just really helps your posture. So my stomach muscles were being stretched out when I, when I was working, working out, especially walking. My calf muscles were being stretched out. And then my feet, because your feet hit the ground differently, kind of like that. My feet were sore. That went away after a couple days. I have absolutely no soreness when I wear these. In fact, like I said, they are the most comfortable shoes that I've ever, ever purchased. I got these from, you can get them from Vibrams.com or Vibrams.com. I'll put the link below. I got them from a sporting goods store here in my town called Canfield, Canfield Sporting Goods. They were $120 um, on sale for $70. And the guy said, if I save my receipt, I could wear these shoes for 30 days. If I wasn't happy, they weren't for me. I can bring them back and I can exchange it for a pair of Nike Reeboks or whatever. So I thought that was a really good deal. So not only will I be not returning them, I'm adding these to my Christmas list because I want another pair in a different color. So they have different models. I'll put the model that I use. I told the guy what I would be using them for. He suggested that. They have a model for if you are predominantly a runner, an outdoor runner. Um, but I told him that I would be walking outside walking on the treadmill and doing Zumba. And these are the shoes he suggested for me. And I absolutely love them. So anyway, that is my quick review on that. I will be back on the 31st to do my weigh-in and I'll see you guys later. Okay guys, so October 31st is here. Happy Friday. I'm about to go into this gym and get on the scale. I'm really excited because I have not gotten on the scale all month. I have no idea what I weigh. Um, I definitely see a big difference in my body toning up. So the weights is making a difference um, in toning. So I'm going to keep doing the weights. And, but the thing about weights, you guys know that uh, muscle weighs more than fat. So when you start lifting weights, the scale may not reflect your weight loss like inches will. So I should have measured myself when I first started, but I never did measure myself. But anyway, um, it has been an awesome, awesome fitness month. My um, Fitbit group on Facebook is amazing. And then I did a 31 day uh, challenge on Facebook also. And um, that was very motivating. So October has been an awesome month. I haven't missed a day working out this month. I haven't cheated outside of my Friday um, cheat meal day. And yeah, just been awesome. So I am expecting a loss. Just not sure how much. Started off originally on August 1st at 198. And I ended, the last time I got on the scale was the end of September and I was 181.7. So I said goodbye to the 190s. I am in the 180s. Hopefully after today I can say goodbye to the 180s. And then my goal for November will be to say goodbye to the 170s. My, my ending goal weight is 168. So that's a 30 pound weight loss. So that's what I'm pushing for. It might take me till the end of the year to do it, but I'm I'm on a roll. So anywho, let me quit rambling and get in here and I will be back. I don't have nobody to hold it. Okay guys, so that is basically a four pound weight loss. I'm loving how my arms is looking. My arms are shaping up so nice. The front part, I still got to get that that back flap. And then my midsection. Let me see if I can get in the mirror so I can show y'all my stomach. So, this right here, y'all see that? That's what I'm working on. My arms are looking nice. Never had a problem with my thighs. In fact, my hips and my butt just went away. They, that was the first thing to go, and I didn't even want that to go. But right here, and that back flap is what I'm trying to get rid of. Anyway, four pounds for the month of October. I can't ask people to uh, hold the camera in this gym. I'm in a new gym um, because the weight, the scale is in the locker room where people are getting dressed. So it's the setup is completely different. 
absolutely love this gym. I switched, someone asked me why I switched to a new gym and it was because um, the hours are more accommodating. The other gym closed early on the weekends and all that so the hours are better. It was $20 cheaper and it's a little closer to my house so it's a win-win all the way around. Still has basketball court for my son to um, play ball when he loves to come and play and then it still has a pool because my husband loves to come and do laps which he hasn't done in a while. I gotta get him back to working out as much as I do. But anywho, that's all I got guys. Somebody's coming. I'll see you guys in my next video.